I'm talking about poles of energy. We okay. have polarity in everything in the universe from the battery. Mm -hmm. You can't put two negatives in, into a battery and it work. You can't put two positives, it has to go flop. So there's poles day and night, everything, yin yang. It's, it's energy and every, we are energy. I don't think everything's polar though. It, it like, is though. Why, and, why apply one lens to well, the Well, you just stepped universe. forward with the prompt that said that I, masculine I mean, men and women's well, differences well, yeah. should be <laughs> celebrated. I, I want to <laughs> celebrate the difference so, between so, men and women, but I feel like you're doing, you have this, you have this tendency to apply sometimes like these quantum or Because like it is, because we live in a quantum macro universe of masculine and feminine everything. energy. But you guys do the same to thing too though. You I think he's just saying to celebrate differences doesn't mean we exist on two opposite poles. And that's and, I, and, I'm, we've spent, okay, and our, I'm saying that, yeah, so like, I'm saying that. There's things exist in nature that are, are triangles or triads, like not everything's yin and yang, you know? But it, but just, it, but it kind of is. Well, I actually well, believe that the masculine energy is a little bit, is elevated in a sense that they have more responsibility as protector, provider. And so for women, we like lean to them and we look up to them as the leader. So not to say that they're not equal, but there's a little bit more responsibility in the masculine field. Right. And without those outlines of structure, then we have chaos and we don't have a society. We have no more children because women aren't having children anymore. I don't think I fear chaos as much as you. I just, I, you, you threw in a little nugget, I have to take it. You, you do <laughs> see women as, as not, I don't. Know, I don't see level. them as the same it, level as me. I just wouldn't, right. I would encourage you, like from a loving place to just maybe Challenge that. Like, what? I how might your how might your experience I change if women, you saw yourself? I think women well, are well. four quarters. A guy is a dollar. I think they're equal. At, they're just not the same. Yeah, I think I, that the the prompt and what I really took to is that it's so important for you guys to celebrate your femininity and celebrate what it means to be a woman for you, and we will joyfully celebrate that with you, right? And likewise to us. However, we want to express our masculinity. That should be celebrated, right? And, yeah, I, of I, and whichever way you had to do it, and like you know, like I said, I don't think it's as rigid as like we want society, to, well, like some people want us to think it is, but it should be celebrated because there are innate differences that are like just biological, and there's going to be those differences, and you know, there shouldn't be anything frowning upon it, like uh, you know, women being like more softer, or emotional. It shouldn't be something frowned upon. But if a man chooses to be that, that shouldn't be like that's feminine, that's not masculine, that's you know, yeah. we should celebrate those qualities and people.